Right, so where we're at now with this uh, this Renault Master. Uh, Basically, I'm getting no no fuel pressure coming up into this coming up into this fuel filter here. Now all the wiring diagrams show that that 20 amp fuse there, where my thumb is, supplies the fuel pump um, in the tank. And I've had my amps clamp on it with uh, with my scope, and it's drawing no current whatsoever, even though it's live. And what I've found, I've gone, uh, I've gone onto all data, and I've got the manufacturer's wiring diagram. And what you can see here, 833 is the pump unit. It's clearly got a motor in it. Follow those wires down to connector R316, and we've got a white wire and a black wire. The white wire is feeding from 1337, which is the protection and switching unit. And then the black wire just goes to earth. Now I've confirmed that I've got power on both sides of that connector. I've confirmed that I've got a ground from here, a good ground, It'll, I've got a really good ground there. So I'm gonna take you under the vehicle now and show you what I've found and where I did my testing. I've also had to put a power supply on onto this and a brilliant little battery support unit that the battery was going flat so we've got it at the minute it's pumping 30 amps into it at the minute so we go under the vehicle it's nice and great love lying on my back at least it's not raining yet now this is you can see here this is the connector that it's on about pin 5 and pin 10 so we've got the the white wire and the black wire that's live coming from the fuse box to the in tank unit in the in the pump down here and that's the earth coming out i've got a live there a live there and an earth here so all i'm going to do now quick do a quick continuity test to see if i've got an open circuit in my pump wiring so rag that off Turn my meter on. You can see it's open circuit at the minute. Get me two wires. Sorry for all the jumping about. But I haven't got a cameraman. Turn my two, two probes together. There's a simple plausibility test without touching the probes. And you can see I've got two ohms. I can steady that now by pressing the rel button on my meter and that'll get it down to 0.2 one side of the connector there give me one second one side of the connector there oh this is horrible this is really horrible trying to do this one handed I don't know how Paul Dana does it Right, so I've got both me, both me leads there, just touching lightly on the terminals. I've not got them stuffed in. You can send me meter. Ouch! Open circuit. So either the windings, either the windings in the pump are uh, open circuit, or there's not actually a pump module fitted to this. Even though the manufacturer's wiring diagram says there is, I can't see any sort of a priming. I mean priming bulb on the on the fuel filter assembly I can't see um, any reason why they would be sending a live wire and a live down that wire if there wasn't a pump so the next job is to connect that wire back up and give it a good old thump on the bottom of the tank Dana style see if we can get the pump running thanks for watching